Hey what's going on gamers, it's Swish Benoit from 24-7 Sim Gaming and today we are going to be taking on a highly requested tutorial and that's how to install Hitman 3 mods using the simple mod framework. So as always, let's start the sim. Alright, so the first thing we need to do as always is go ahead and open up Steam, go to our library tab, we're going to click Hitman 3, and we're going to right click it and we're going to go to properties and let's click local files here and we're going to click browse. And this is going to pop up our main game directory for installing our Hitman mods. So what we need to do is go over to the top left here, right click quick access, and we're going to pin current folder to quick access. That way we can always be able to locate this file quick and easily for the future. All right, now that we have that done, let's go ahead and follow that first link in the description below. And that's going to take us to the simple mods framework on Nexus. And if you don't have a Nexus account, it's really, really easy to sign up for one. It just takes a couple minutes and needs your email only, and it's completely free. So now that we're here, let's go ahead and click manual download on the Simple Mod Framework installer. And that's going to take us to this page and we can click slow download. And it takes just a second. It's an EXE file, but it's perfectly safe. So let's go ahead and open that up. And you may get a notification that Windows has protected your PC, the Windows Defender. Just go ahead and click more info then click run anyway and when this pops up it's going to want you to select your game folder so let's go ahead and give that a click and we just saved our game folder into our quick access so it's going to be to the left of your screen and there it is hitman 3 so we're going to click hitman 3 and that's our main directory and we'll select folder and you'll get a little cogwheel that may be loading with a selection folder but once you've done that you're all good to go let's go ahead and close that down so now let's go back to that main game directory that we opened up earlier and it's going to take us to this hitman 3 page which is steam library steam apps common hitman 3 we're going to click simple mod framework mod manager and the mod manager exe and you can drag this over to your desktop if you want to create a shortcut for it that's perfectly fine so let's go ahead and open that up and give it just a second as it goes ahead and loads up there as we've got an update here so I'm going to go ahead and quickly download that update, going to need to do that. And now that my update is finished, we're going to go over to the left side of the page and we're going to click the second one down below. And let's go ahead and minimize this a bit here. Now we need to go to the second link in the description, which is going to take us to the custom FOV and camera. And we have the same thing here. Let's go ahead and click manual download, download and slow download there and it's going to take just a second so now that we have that done we don't need to open up this file we just want to leave it as a zip file and let's go back to that mod manager so now that we're in here we'll already have realistic ai it's going to be inside of your folder already when you download this so we're going to go ahead and click add a mod and we need to locate the one we just downloaded in our downloads and it'll be custom fov we're just going to click the zip folder and we're going to click select and it's going to unzip that thing and bring it all the way inside for you now we want to click the enable button and as you see it'll be in our enable mods tab and we have a cogwheel next to it where we can actually go ahead and configure our settings that we want so i'm going to have mine at 80 and far default zoom behavior and let's click that left tab again so take us back and now that we have that done let's go ahead and click apply and you'll see that your mods are being deployed and depending on how many you have it might take a little bit longer than other times but just be patient and when that is done you will see the deploy successful so go ahead and click that blue close marker and we are done installing mods for simple mod framework so the next thing we need to do is just go ahead and go inside the game and check out our new fov all right guys as you can see here our fov is installed and running absolutely great no issues here i may switch this up a little bit make it just a little bit closer it's a little far out for me but that's it for this video if you like this video please make sure to drop a like leave a comment let me know how you're enjoying this new hitman world of assassination update let me know what some of your favorite mods are down below click that subscribe button as it helps my channel tremendously and as always until next time take care of yourself and each other